Hello everyone and welcome back for some more Wolfric the Wanderer in SFO. And Wolfric is just out hunting lizards because we still haven't found any and I've heard they can put up a pretty good fight so we're not leaving here until we find some lizards. And we're feeling very healthy so we're just gonna pop on march stands and just book it down south because we don't really care about the Imperials anymore because we've already beaten them up pretty good and they don't really have anything we want so we're just gonna ignore them. Meanwhile, back home, we have champions of the Hound and the Serpent coming for us because we have become the champion of the Crow. But since they didn't seem to know Wolfric was out wandering, Throg and friends are gonna deal with them. They should have just come down to Lustria and Rumble, but oh well. This is gonna be fine. And we've left a little bit of a ambush over here, but I think we might just... Uh, actually, they are in range, but Zazel is there. Oh, they have a lot of Seeker Chariots. Actually, I'm just gonna stay in ambush there for a little bit. We don't need to move Surthak anywhere in particular. And we've gotten the exalted un Great Unclean one. And we're getting a bunch of monsters. Because I, th I think that feels fitting. And we're probably gonna use him and Surtha to deal with Fator the Serpent once he gets to us. We also have a tech to get. And uh, I think we're just gonna keep getting some, uh, some buffs to our cav. We could grab this, but... I think I'd rather have this. I think it's more fun. Give some armor to our little kind of squishy, squishy cat. So let's just pass the turn and uh, see if we can find some lizards next turn. A negotiation. How about this? And Catherine wants peace. No, you know what you did. The migration. A great migration comes to our borders, and that's just gonna be a bunch of growth and lower our control. So. I don't think we need this because we are already pretty good on growth and we don't need that control downgrade. So, be gone with you. Oh, and Boris is a new... Oh, hello. Look who showed up. I mean, I know I said the Imperials didn't really interest us anymore, but he's just serving himself up on a silver platter here. So, it would be rude not to kill him. So, we're just going to take a little bit of a detour and go and kill Marcus. And we're going to attack from this angle so that we... Because we are going to raise this, so I just want to run at the right angle here. And, oh, is this a settlement battle? It looks like it. And it is my least favorite map in the entire game. So, I think we can take uh, medium casualties to avoid fighting this. <laughs> yeah, we're just going to take it. We shouldn't take that much damage though. Yeah, it's not too bad. As long as we can raid a little bit, we should be alright, so I guess just raise it for the crow. Because we are the champion of the crow now. And we're gonna get a range boost, missile strength boost, and missile resistance, which isn't bad at all. And yeah, we're gonna mostly recover here. Two turns and we're good. Wait, what? Wait. We don't get this until we kill both of those guys. Is this an SFO bug mishap thing or is this... Is this actually in vanilla game? Because that shouldn't be eliminate any lord. That should be, de be defeating Vashnar the Hound. Okay, so the game's messed up. <laughs> um... And they kind of skipped us having to fight the things. I mean, we are still gonna... F I, okay, we're still gonna fight the... Uh, the champions that popped up. And then we're gonna do the, the final quest battle because... We definitely didn't beat these guys. So we're gonna keep chasing you and you need to stop running away. So, they are mostly Chosen and Chaos Warriors. Got some Chaos Knights and some Trolls and some Hell Cannons. We should be able to beat that. And you are at least coming towards us. And can... I mean, you... Can you reach that? I don't think you can reach that. It looks like you, they kind of can't reach that, so... Oh, probably because we're in the way. Ah, you know what? We can probably take them on. So we're just gonna occupy this because I want it back. And we can probably take them on. I'm not I'm not afraid of you. 
So let's grab some. Uh, uh, what do we want? Maybe the trolls. We need to upgrade these as well. Oh, and we don't have this. Let's grab that. Upgrade that. I guess we haven't done this for in a while. I guess we can have one of each. Yeah, let's do that. So you still have three turns. And as long as you're not march dancing, we might reach you in two turns. So we're gonna keep chasing you. Oh yeah. You could probably go and take this if you wanted to. Because you're healthy. Can even give you the Hounds of Tashnar. Yeah, let's just go and do that. Might as well. Freak victory. Ah, it doesn't matter. Yeah, let's gonna kill some elves here. And we'll just uh, grab some reinforcements. No problem. So let's just keep on moving in that case. Oh, we are gonna. Ha oh wait, that's that's help it. That's definitely help it. Because I thought we we're gonna have a rebellion, but yeah, that's that's just help it. Continuously rebelling. And yeah, that's just that's just our regular regular rebellion. And, oh, damn. Marcus has been tearing these guys up. But, oh, there we go. We found Gorok, but there's Alberic. Are you at... No, you're not at war with each other. Okay. So we could take all of these on at the same time if we wanted to. And it seems like we're gonna have a dwarf endgame here. Alright, that's fine. So hopefully we don't have to fight you in Itza, because that seems miserable. So so we'll see if they come out and fight. That would be much more fun. You're just being ignored. That's perfectly fine. Might pop you into ambush stance again. Because we're mostly just waiting for these guys to get here. And we got two more turns of... Actually, you need to start moving down there. So let's just pop on down there, because these guys are going to take on the Serpent together, because I don't trust them to do it on their own. And yeah, they are they are moving quite fast. That is incredibly annoying. Well, we'll get to them soon enough. And the Monument of Isatal is falling, but... That's fine. We don't really care about it. You can have it back. We're done with it. Oh, shit. Oh, I, I didn't realize we were this close to the settlement, but I guess we are. I mean, I think we can just fall back, because I'd rather not fight this way while we're a little bit hurt. And uh, if we fall back, we can just go and kill Alberic anyway. So, yeah, I think we're just gonna tactically retreat. Sacrificial Altars. Your seers discovers a pair of sacrificial altars with a strange and unknown runes on them. One altar is shaped like a, like a ravenous beast. The other is in the form of a peculiar reptilian creature. Both are ancient and the powers in them has slumbered for years untold. Both need blood to awaken. But which altar should, should your seers sacrifice slaves upon? So, uh, recruit rank for skin wolves or rec recruit rank for female bale fiends? Well, I don't think we're gonna r realistically use a lot of any of those anymore. But I guess we might grab some some uh, werekins or whatever. So, oh, you. Dang it. They're standing right next to it. That's annoying. Well, I guess we can just uh, keep moving south. Because we shouldn't be in range of anything right there. Yeah, that, that should be fine. And we're gonna heal plenty here. And worst case, we can just... Oh! Gorok just left. So we won't have to fight him in Itza. Hopefully he's out and about and we can just jump him. Yeah, so that's fine. I would like to fight Alberic, but I'll r I'd rather not have a big garrison to help him. And I don't see the hounds. So let's just... Oh, come on. 
Where? There you are. Okay, so we are catching up to him at the very least. We might be able to reach him next turn. Hopefully. Please stop running away. Oh, and you're going up... Or going down south. That's alright. Let's move on over there. And yeah, next turn we can start moving towards them. So that's gonna be good. Yeah, you seem to have gotten beaten up. You need to defend your stuff. Actually... You might just get killed. Do you have any... Okay, they do have some other dark fortresses, so they'll be fine. But they are not having a good time. So, let's see if... Uh, if Alberic does something stupid here. And the Daily Rebellion. So, Alberic is just sneaking up on us. He's not getting any backup here. And uh, Gorok is not back there, but... Yeah, they didn't want to fight. I thought so. But you never know. Worth a try. Let's go and have a look in Itza. Oh, do you... You only have two settlements. So you're probably over there then. Because Albrick, I mean Albrick and Wolf, or no, not Wolfric, uh, Albrick and Marcus has just been beating up its it seems. So I guess just raid him a little. Oh, that is some nice raiding. Yeah, so we'll go and check over there, I guess. See if they're hanging out right there. And how are they moving so fast? They don't seem to be having any kind of... I mean, they don't... They're not in march stance or anything. How are you moving so far? So, let's pop over right there. That might be good enough. Hopefully we can kill him next turn. You're running away. Please stop. Don't be like the other guy. Just stop. So, stay in range at the very least. Because you need to back each other up. And just keep passing the turn. Because they just won't let it be. What kind of garrison do you have there? Hmm, pretty big. You know what? Let's go back to Lothurn. Hang out there. Defend. You'll be fine. Oh, they're taking it back. Bastards. And Archeon wants a non-aggression pact. You know what? Sure. Okay, let's have a look over there. It seems like we can reach that, and that is not where he's hanging out. Did they kill you? They might have just killed you. That is incredibly annoying. And I really don't want to fight that siege battle, so... Oh. Get out of there. Wait, why can't I attack? Oh, because I... What happened to my movement range? Okay, whatever. We're gonna spend one more turn here raiding, and then I'll get... I guess we'll just attack Kotl. And see what happens. This is very, very disappointing. Like, we didn't get to fight Master Mundi, we don't get to fight Gorok, because it seems like everyone else has already gotten to it first. But we should be able to fight this guy at the very least. Yes! Okay. Finally. First out of two big fights. And it is gonna be a Pyrrhic victory according to this. And yeah, the Hell Cannons are kinda scary, but we have mostly pretty loose formations. The Chaos Giants is also kind of scary, but we got some big anti-large. So, and Chosen are always scary, but this is going to be a fun one, I think. So, we're going to have to try to take out their Hell Cannons, because they are kind of scary. And can we actually... Yeah, we can actually just pop them back there. So, we're just going to send them in the rear and try to take out the Hell Cannons. And they should be fast enough to just avoid anything they send back if they're trying to defend it. The rest of our stuff, we are just gonna 
spread out a little bit, I guess. We don't need to spread it out too much since uh, they have a lot of infantry. So we might want to just uh, stay kind of tight formation here. Because we don't have that much to actually protect our stuff. So let's pop you there. We'll uh, pop you there. Yeah, you're... You're both anti-infantry, so it's probably better having you around here. And do... Oh, you should be group one. And we'll do it like that. So, let's move up. Try to use this for cover. And I guess just go and hit this. See how they defend it. We can always run back if we need to. And they are a little bit confused, so they're not even shooting us. So I guess while they're figuring out how to do this, we'll just we're just gonna attack. Move you up, start throwing. And see how they react to this. They do have some chosen right there, so let's actually Oh, come on. Turn around, you dumb idiots! <laughs> okay. They are catching them a little bit. It's fine, they're just ice wolves. And we are getting in there, so let's try to vomit on these guys. Send you in on the Chaos Trolls, you'll be fine. And are we getting down the line there and even hitting some Chaos Knights? Yeah, pretty good. So, let's kill that stuff. You're gonna start throwing. You're ready to go again, so let's go and hit the Hell Cannon. Because now they're turning back to... To this attention. Let's have you throw at the giant because they are actually kind of scary. Probably have a pretty good pit of shades right there. Let's get that overcasted pit of shades. That is gonna annihilate these guys. So they were pretty healthy to start with. Now they are just dead. <laughs> Took some damage on these guys, but that's fine. You'll deal with that now. Let's uh, switch targets, start killing that thing. You're doing alright, I suppose. And the hell cannons are pretty much done. So, let's go and deal with that. We can buff you a little bit. You're taking some damage, though. I don't like that. So, get on top of that. Please don't kill my caster. I uh, very much would not like it. Oh, he's in the middle of Chosen. That explains it. But at least do a little bit of damage there. Start throwing into the Chosen. Actually, you're just gonna pull out of there while the trolls can deal with that. We'll uh, do some of that. And yeah, the trolls are just surrounding this idiot. That is going to be a nasty beating. Yeah, he's not going to last very long in that surround. Come on. Just bonk him. <laughs> I can watch this all day. He is... Oh, yeah, okay. One HP. That was a terrible time to check the HP. <laughs> Go and help out with that. Oh, everything else is dead. Yeah, this is all they have. Oh, they have a good surround on us, though. Let's uh, send in some hounds, but I think that is pretty much game. Yeah, that is... That's our losses. We just need to kill these Chaos Spawn. So we're just gonna fast forward until they are dead. Yeah, so that was pretty fun. We got to surround and bonk a, a little bitch. And we did not take a lot of damage. And that Pit of Shades was value. 4,000. I don't think he did very much in melee combat. And I don't think that Pendulum was very big either. I was just... I think it hit a Chosen, like a Chaos Knight, and probably a couple of Chaos Warriors or something. So that was just nasty. So, he's dead. And I mean... I guess he is running away a little bit, but that should absolutely just done. Oh, you haven't gotten that yet. 
Oh, you still haven't finished this. Right. Let's do that. I eat my enemies. You can eat your enemies soon enough. And I guess just grab that, I suppose. Right, and I don't think this matters too much, so let's do that. And we can't... Where the hell are you going? Okay, well... Uh, how far can you reach? Uh, far enough. Come on. Come, come on. Oh, right. Your... Your area thingy. So, you do have Root Marcher. That's good. Um, I guess... Uh, let's grab some melee attack. You'll be fine. But, you haven't actually done anything, so we should ha absolutely have Root Marcher. We need Stream of Corruption. This will bring and I think that's pretty good. Such joy. And did we move you this turn? Yeah, we Challenger. did. Okay, so since he's probably dead, I think we might actually give up on Lizardmen. Because I don't think they're alive down here. I mean, I guess... Uh, what is it? Tenuan is down here, but... We might just go and uh, see if we find uh, Bordelo anyway. So let's pass the turn and see if we can catch this guy. And I think we're just gonna kill this guy and then we are doing the quest battle. And yeah, yeah. So, Eyeless Whispers. I am a coward and. Man, they have too far of a movement. Yeah, all right. Well, uh, keep running around in March stance then. Ooh, and we're about to take some attrition here. Nope, not right there. Wait, wait, come on. Can we not stand there? Oh, dang it. Come on. Ah, crap. Okay, there's no attrition there, I suppose. And we are reinforcing. Well, you are just being the worst, I guess. So, let's start running back home. Or home. We're running back here. Can we land here? Yeah, we can. So, we're gonna try and just meet up over there in that case. See what happens. You don't matter. And, uh, yeah, let's just... Yeah, there's Alberic, so... Let's not stand too close to this. So we're gonna try to hunt him down. And if we don't reach him before we kill the Serpent, we're just gonna do the quest battle, I suppose. Well, aren't you... Oh, damn, we did a lot of damage there. Aren't you brave? We might just go and kill them with Throg, though. And Lewin is taking Marienburg. Well, it's... Thought that was gonna happen earlier. Yeah, whatever. And they're just sacking it. Okay. Oh, the Vermintide. It was foolish to be worried about any Skaven gathering other than a few scattered scouts. Well, there's gonna be a lot of Skaven, and god damn it, Fater the Serpent! I didn't know the Serpent was the goddamn Chaos God of Cowards. Well, we're gonna keep chasing, because we definitely can't reach him. And yeah, there's gonna be a lot of Skaven. I thought it was the Dwarves, but I guess that's the text for... for Skaven invasion. Although... Full disclosure, it did... I did have a crash, so I did have to reload a turn pass. So it might have changed something, but... Or it's just uh, I misinterpreted the the message. Either way, let's... Uh... Oh, hello. Well, that's fun. We could kill Rakarth. Although we have trades with him, so I guess not. <laughs> Let's just see if we find Alberic. Oh, and there he is. So, we could try to kill him. 
or we just do the quest battle because I am getting sick of chasing these little idiots. Because I would like to fight them, but they're just running away from us. And I don't know why it's coded that they're just fleeing. They're here as... They're here to hunt us down for becoming the champion of the crow. Why are they running? I absolutely hate you. <laughs> And what do you want? No, go away. Oh, hello. That's a solution, I suppose. <laughs> okay, that is an excellent solution, because having a bunch of Chaos Worshippers join in on your side is an excellent way of fighting off Norska. A bunch of Chaos Worshippers. <laughs> yeah, alright. I'm not gonna question it. I am gonna give you to that guy though because you're gonna get real tanky and uh, we'll see how this turns out well, we should be able to deal with this do we give this to the AI or do we just ah let's just control all of it so their starting army isn't really that threatening because well it's kind of small and shitty so we're just gonna send in our chariots first to ram them a little bit and maybe throw some axes because it is axes you got, right? Yeah, you got a axe thrower back there, which makes sense considering the range. But yeah, you're gonna be fine. Meanwhile, we are just gonna put up a nice, thick, meaty front line here. Like so. And just kind of wait for our reinforcements, because I think they're gonna kind of have to attack. Although, yeah, they do have, have um, hell cannons. So they might just sit back and shoot at us. I don't know. We'll see. I pr would prefer not to attack into them. And yeah, you are anti-large when you're not the regiment of renown. So actually, you can be group three, and you can also be group three. These guys are just gonna hang out back here in group two. Did you have your chariot yet? No, you're kind of a chariot lord, are you? on your horse and you're just gonna be group one so let's start that and of course they're gonna set up all the way back there come on but let's uh, go and hide all of these in the woods see if we can get a jump on them or do we want to be over there well they are setting up in the corner so I think they might go here otherwise they're pretty quick we'll uh, we'll get to use them Although, speaking of not so quick, though, man, you're taking forever to get there. You got 110 speed, but you're still not over there? Okay, um, I don't think this is gonna happen because uh, they're gonna be here in 15 seconds. Okay, we're, we're backing off. Um, let's put them up as kind of bait over there instead. That's gonna be fine. And our reinforcements are here in 15 seconds. Yeah, so we're just gonna let them come in that case. Let's uh, rotate you a little bit. Yeah. Oh well. That is fine. Let's grab all of you and just uh, drag out the front line. And let's do like that. We'll pop you on over there. The rest we are gonna... We are gonna put over here in that line. Just spread them out. Spread the love. You're both gonna be group one. You're gonna be group one. You can be group five though, because you're you're gonna be a good like assassin. What happened to your health? What happened to your health? I guess we took some attrition. Huh. All right. That's annoying. But that is everything. And are you just gonna sit here? Okay, now they're starting to move out because they actually got into formation. They just kind of got into formation and then instantly started moving again. So let's actually send these to start throwing some axes because all of our skin wolves are gonna pounce on these. Actually, you're gonna go around. They don't have the greatest AP. But four units of them should be able to just beat up a unit of Chaos Knights. The armor is problematic, but shouldn't be that problematic. Yeah, we're we're just 
slaughtering that, and they are thinking better of it. Oh, and now they're stopping again. Okay, well, we're getting to kill these Chaos Knights at the very least. We got some throwing axes in it. And yeah, we're gonna finish those off. They seem to... to just kind of move towards it. Yeah, we'll see. Okay, our skin wolves are getting stuck in the forest, which doesn't make sense because they're skin wolves. They should know how to navigate the woods. But let's... Uh, they are just coming in with things in the woods. A guy on a horse and a snow leopard, so we should be alright just killing this. You should just sit there and throw your axes at the boyar, and we should be pretty alright here. Got some Chaos Warriors coming. But other than that, everything is coming right towards us. So yeah, that should be a pretty free fight. And I think we're just gonna hit like that and just move out. You can start just moving up. Actually, just gather over there. You should have some good stuff to just fight there. And we'll move around with you. Because now they're starting to shoot us. And they got some halberds, but I don't think we care. Let's uh, let's turn these guys into combat mode and start running over some Streltsy. Yeah, just surround you and do your chariot things. Push through, push, push. Come on, we got some Chaos Warriors with halberds, so let's try to pull out of that. But we're dealing with that at the very least. And we're trying to push through halberds. And this is menacing. Just a huge thick Norsken army just moving in on, on them. So you need to get out of there. We're gonna take another lap. We kinda just wanna kill this guy. And then we're gonna pull out. Ow. Stop shooting my things, you bastards. Oh yeah, actually, that's a pretty good target there. Yeah, you're broken. Let's pull out of there. And yeah, let's... Uh, throw some axes first. Come on. What is wrong with your axes? There you go. And then we charge them. There we go. And pull through. Get into those guys. Finish him off. We're fine. And okay. Let's do some streams of corruption through there, I think. And I think most things are fighting something. Ow. Not a fan of that. Yeah, you should be fine there. Um, prefer if you don't fight a bunch of halberds, but if you have to, I guess it's not the end of the world. But you just try to get to these Akshina ambushers and run through them instead. There we go, you're doing fine, you're doing fine. Oh, right, these guys. They're supposed to take the them out. Oh, and you can go and land on the hag mother. So, you keep fighting there. That's a pretty decent miasma as well. No, not miasma. Stream of corruption. Let's try to pull through. Go and hit that. And see if you can just try to run around. Because we are fighting Alberts. It's not a good fight for us. So try to pull out and just run around instead. Hit that, hit that, you're doing fine. You're trying to find, fight the Chaos Lord. You're actually doing pretty alright though. Let's uh, help you out a little bit. That's all looking good, that's all looking good. Let's avoid these idiots and run around. Ooh, that's hurting though. Um, 
Yeah, let's just grab all of these and run back into them. It'll be fine. You're doing great. Stream of corruption. Let's grab... Uh, let's just go through there. Should do some decent damage. And... I actually ran through it a little bit. I feel like the chariot charges have been a little bit limp. But that's probably partially my own fault. But those are shut down at the very least. You're doing all... Oh, okay, you actually just broke. That's fine. You're doing fine. Oh, but you are just annihilating the Hag Mother. Very good. So, let's... Uh, yeah, let's go after the Chaos Lord. Oh, you... You weren't supposed to switch, though. You finished that Hag Mother off. We got wolves coming in to deal with that. And let's just get up some volleys on that. You should be alright. Kill those guys. And man, you are slow for 80 speed. Damn. Okay, now you go after that. Wait, you didn't even try. What is wrong with you? That's alright. We've taken care of the cannons. These guys are doing great. This blob is just doing fine. Not gonna micro that anymore. Go and hunt that thing down. Okay, you go and kill that. The Frost Maiden is gonna die here, so let's send you in after the Chaos Trolls over there. Let's grab two of them, actually. You'll be fine. You're shattered. Excellent. The Hell Cannon needs to shatter as well. But that seems to be mostly kind of army losses. Because there's a lot of stuff break... Actually, you are unbreakable. That's why. And you're unbreakable. So let's just debuff you a little bit. Let's grab the giants. Because they are very good at just clobbering some stuff. And you, of course. But yeah, other than that, I think we are pretty damn all... Well, I guess the Chosen are also not unbreakable. They're just... They're just sturdy. <laughs> so yeah, you'll be fine. You'll be fine. Let's go and throw some stuff into you. Grab you guys and... I know there's halberds in there. But that's fine. We're just gonna fast forward now because we mostly just need to kill that thing and break some of these Chaos Warriors. So we should be alright there. And there he goes. And that's the game. So, there we go. Who, who would have thought that... Uh, the only way to getting to fight these guys was to get some help from our friendly neighborhood Kislev. So let's just grab that, I suppose, in case they want to attack us again. I usually negotiate. Uh, no. Oh, okay. Again? Sure. Now they're taking it. All right. And. One more rebellion. I feel like you should just team up and take help it. With with both your forces combined, I think you could do it. So let's just grab some war fervor. Because uh, with the serpent army dead, we can finally do the final quest battle. Oh, and you leveled a little bit. So let's grab... I mean, the glittering robe is alright. Might be nice if we need to. Oh, actually, just 50 melee attack is pretty good. To the four corners. And, uh, yeah, let's just grab some extra attack. And let's do the final... Oh, right. <laughs> I thought, like, what? Wait, can't we teleport? But yeah, we can. The Eagle's Challenger. So, we get to fight a bunch of Chosen, a bunch of Forsaken, some Hounds of Decay... Oh, the Hounds of Decay are actually kind of, kind of badass. Love the SFO Hounds of Decay. Dragon Ogres, Chaos Trolls. 
Chaos Spawn and a Hell Cannon. And the Hell Cannon is going to be especially strong against this army since our Marauder Champions are so tightly packed. But we should be... it should be pretty much like the other ones. So let's do it. Yeah, let's fucking kill him. They're rooting for the wrong sports team. I mean, Chaos God. But we are going to be fighting Asric the Maze Keeper, who is obviously going to have some Zinchian magics, but he also have Soul Leech of Zinch, which is going to do a lot of damage over a fairly long time. Hmm, that's like Spirit Leech on crack. And Unholy Pact with the Changer, which is going to be a decent or a really big heal actually. And it's going to affect lots of stuff. Okay, well that's not great. How many of these do you get? Hopefully just one, but we'll see. We might have to... Well, we can't kill you quickly because you're going to be imbued with protection. Which is that, I think. Okay, so it's four minutes. So if you, if you hit this right away, which you might do, then we can kind of just sit back and wait for this to run out. Other than that, there's nothing too bad to worry about, so I think we're just gonna sit and wait that out. And this thing is gonna be a little bit awkward, but they have most of their stuff back here, so... I think we're just gonna set up on this side, so get out of the way. And let's pop you there. Pop you. And pop you. And I think we're gonna have kind of a tight formation because we want them to bunch up a lot for our spells. Let's pop. Actually, let's do a little bit more room like that and that. And we're still going pretty wide though. But that's gonna be alright. We're just gonna go and sit basically right here. We might use this as cover to avoid getting flanked by their uh, Hounds of Decay. Uh, let's pop you there, pop you there. Pop you there and pop you there. So we're gonna move all that to the side. You can be group 5 because I need to keep track of you. You can be group 1 and hang out with Wolfric. And stay with you. You're gonna. You're gonna, just gonna create a mosh pit with Wolfric. And that's gonna be great. Oh, and all of these. So, we can either just go over here and try to um, like pull some stuff to the side while we attack on this side although we don't have a lot of space to just run past them we do have some mountainside we can run on here and I do want to get on top of the hell cannon so let's just put you over there and that's gonna be perfectly fine and we're gonna try to get forward a little bit just try to keep out of range of that hell cannon which seems to have like that ish range it's easier to see if you just turn it this way so I know where I can stand. <laughs> and we're just gonna sit here and... Uh, yeah, okay, that's kind of perfect. Yeah, we're just gonna sit here until... Actually, did you pop it? Yeah, okay. I thought they would, because, you know, the AI. <laughs> so, that's fine. Oh, shit! They are getting reinforcements! And it's only about 15, oh, 17 seconds left, so I guess we're just gonna start moving out. Ah, oh, shit, they're getting... they're getting beastmen! That's... that's unfair! Okay, so that is running out. And let's get all of you... oh, right, we need you! Okay, so that is done. You are in the group, so let's just... Get you. Start moving forward. Let's start moving you up. And good. They are getting a little bit confused with their cannon. Oh shit! Oh shit! They're getting they're getting reinforcements over here. <laughs> okay. Well, 
The mammoths... Uh, okay, we need to take care of these mammoths. Start throwing shit at them. Uh, pull out. Well, we're doing good damage here at the very least. Okay, let's uh, wait on starting attacking with... Oh, come on. Okay, one of you needs to start throwing shit at you. Oh, and you keep moving. Keep killing this thing. You need to kill that thing. Let's try to get on top of that. And you just try to have these guys stop moving and we're fine. Yeah, you're gonna be taken out here. Guess we should move up with the rest of our, our shit. Oh, you get out of there. And we're all dealing with that, so that's good. So, you try to save some of your health. And actually, our whalers are dealing with that, so... Oh, that would have been such a juicy um, sea fang, but oh well. Yeah, you're you're dealing with that. That's good. Very good, 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 good. Yeah. Start riding up. Um, you guys need to start getting in formation again. Where are you? Well, stop that. Let's get back moving. Get moving. And yeah, we're killing this guy, so that's pretty good. And we're getting some javelins into these guys, which is also pretty good. We're getting our stuff in formation. And I think we're just gonna... Well, no. I don't know what to have on the flank. Because I don't... It's just gonna get annihilated by all of these minotaurs and chaos spawn. And holy shit, they're... Wait, what is up with their Chaos Spawn? Why does it have 358 damage? And re Oh my god, their Chaos Spawn is cheating. <laughs> well, that's some bullshit. Okay, well... They don't seem to be shooting very much. But we should be moving up anyway. Let's... Okay, now they're starting to shoot. Dodge! Dodge! Okay, that wasn't that bad. Let's get up here, and we really need to, sh to kill their Chaos Spawn at range, it seems like. Oh, you can- we can- we can use this. That's- that's impassable. So, get that. You're being dealt with. Sit and throw some shit over there. Trying to kill our stuff with their Hell Cannon. And they're kind of succeeding. Okay, you get in there and fight. You you go and help. Go and help with that. You're doing great. And that's the changer thing happening. So, go in there and fight. Oh, that's not my mammoth. Right. Oh, dodge! But, let's get a sea fang through there. Kill all of that. If we can, let's pull you back. Try to kill these Chosen. Oh, shit! Um, where are you? You need to back away a little bit. But, cast that. And yes, we are gonna do some pausing, because I usually try to avoid that, but we need this here. Just wanna make sure everything is popped. And yeah, let's pop that as well. And everyone throw at that. Get your throws in there. Did we ever get... Yeah, we did get Sea Fang over there, so... You go in there and fight. Let's do the... Searing Doom right there. But yeah, this guy should be going down pretty quick. You go and fight there, you go and help. Go and help. Go and help. Oh, you need to pull out. Don't want you fighting Chosen in melee combat. But yeah, this guy is just dead. So you can start throwing into those Chaos Bomb because they are... They're just cheating. 
And I don't, I don't appreciate it. And yeah. I keep throwing just AoE spells over there. Try to ride you up on the flank. Let's grab one of you to just charge in there. Peel that away. Let's charge these hounds with the K. Peel that away. Let's uh, say fight this chaos spawn. Because they are cheating. And I don't like it. Get a big throw over there. These guys are dead. Very good. Oh, and you can just go and fight over there. That's going to be excellent. Doing all right. Throw these. Oh, actually, every all of you should be throwing into Chaos Bomb. Because they are just ridiculous. Let's go and help out with that. And you should be... Well, throw into those guys. They're also dangerous. Let's get some in over there. These Chaos Spawn are dying, which is great. Get one of those. Oh, shit! We got Chosen coming back. Uh, you have a Sea Fang again. But... I think we might be saving that a little bit. Yeah, we got that. Very good. Let's go and thoroughly break that. Come on. Pop that thing. Those are dead. Very good. Go and help out over there. Oh, there's Chaos Trolls over here. Let's try to avoid that. Let's, uh... Oh, whoops. Let's go and chase you off and you off. Do they have a Lord here? No, but they do have a Chaos Bond that's about to die, which is great. Um, C Fang, go through there. Kill those things. You're all right. Square up. Everyone, go over there. Make sure they don't come back, because I don't want to fight them again. Make sure they don't come back, because I don't want to fight them again either. Here comes a bunch of trolls. Target them. And I think we got this. Holy crap, that was that was rough. Because those, those Chaos Spawn are just cheating. <laughs> Which is super rude. But there we go. Excellent. So that was really rough, but turned out very well. But the worst part was just these Chaos Spawn were definitely kind of cheat. Oh my god, what money. <laughs> but these Chaos Spawn definitely got way more buffed than they had any right to be because like 350 uh, weapon strength on a, what was it, 10, 12, 8 model unit is ridiculous. Regeneration, like 10,000 HP, a shield. These guys were jacked. But uh, as long as we just focus them down, I guess it was alright. But yeah, I got a little bit nervous there for a while. But it turned out pretty well. So we are, well, it doesn't really matter what we're going to pick. Because I think we're just going to... I think we're just going to end this series here, actually. Because, uh, well, the monster hunts doesn't work, which sucks. Because I was looking forward to doing a bunch of these. And I know there, there's there been a bug a while that the monster hunts di uh, didn't work, but I thought it got fixed, but I guess it didn't. So we can't do any of these. And we finished the final quest battle. Actually, how close are we? Uh, we're actually really close to a long campaign victory. But... I don't really feel like going around just sacking, racing, or loot looting 11 more settlements because I feel like we've gotten to do what we wanted to do. Except kill lizards, but these damn lizards don't even, can't even put up a fight. So yeah, I, 
super fun campaign though. I really like go just going around with Wolfric doing whatever we want. We are very far from home. Went down the donut. We spent a little bit too much time in the donut. But um, I was hoping for the Sword of Cain. But they still haven't drawn it. The only reason why we went to the donut was to pick up the Sword of Cain. So we could just steamroll shit. And I am so mad that they <laughs> just didn't draw it. Ah, uh, like every other campaign, Alariel just beelines it there and just draws it and just love it and uh, loves the curse. But of course, when we want the Sorrow Cane, she just ignores it. Typical. But it was still a super fun campaign. Love just globetrotting with uh, Wolfric, but if we didn't spend as much time here, we could have probably made it to maybe the Southlands as well. Probably got here before all the lizards were dead and all of that fun stuff. But we still got the authentic Norskan experience as well, with with um, Throg just running around in the Empire, which is always fun. But I didn't want to spend the entire game doing that, so I'm, I'm happy with just having Throg do that while Wolfric did his own thing. I thought that was a lot more fun, and I hope you had fun watching this. So yeah, I'm gonna end this here. Thank you so much for watching this series, I hope you enjoyed it, I had a great time. Uh, there might not be a like another campaign with daily or every other day uh, of a video campaign with Warhammer 3 coming. But I might start a stream that I think would be fun. Because next campaign is probably going to be a Crusader Kings campaign, but it uh, might be a stream. So look out for that or enjoy the Kree campaign that's still going. So thank you so much for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.